Angie Pubs. Um, it's, it's very individual, really, to each person. Each person's personality comes in very much to a pub, uh, dependent on uh, the size of the pub, dependent on how you need to adopt uh, and embrace change within your unit. Uh, as an example, you may have a unit which is very busy at lunch times and very quiet in the evening. Well, you need to make sure that you're creating an environment at lunchtime which is going to be fun, um, efficient, very quick service for people coming in, having lunch, a nice environment. And also in the evenings, it would then be your responsibility to bring yourself, your personality, and also um, a nice ambiance to the business in order to drag people through the door and get them to spend their hard earned money. Uh, as an example, with the flask here, it's very much uh, hands on, very people orientated business. We like to see people coming in from midday when we start food. Some of our regulars come here earlier, 11 in the morning, um, or in our business, and pints of bitter. Uh, they're the backbone of our business. You know, we look after them, we manage the people here, we manage our staff well. There's a lot of staff interaction. The customers love to speak with the staff. You know, they're almost like friends. They almost know each other you know, better than friends, which is great. It creates a big atmosphere, a nice environment to be in, which is the most important thing. And that, in turn, helps to take away and detract from trouble, from arguments, from conflict with customers, and reduces the incidence of fighting and public disorder. <laughs>